Alrighty, guys. So, I am back with another plush review. So, yes, this is going to be for, uh, I mean, March's unboxing. I was going to say October, but no. October is not here yet. We got, like, eight more months. So, yeah. So, this is for March's unboxing compilation. So, we got the plushy John Cena from Walmart. I bought it yesterday. And I gotta say, um, the hair is the same color like the Undertaker's hair. I don't know why. They couldn't make it brown, but I'm okay on how the color of the hair is. So, yep, uh, he got his little Sapphire Series 2017 attire on, which is pretty cool. So yeah, let's go ahead and take the tag off, shall we? Okay, guys. So here is John Cena without the tag. And the uh, sneakers are blue. So yeah, and this plus review is going to get 100 out of 100. But anyway, guys, uh, stay tuned for the unboxing later. And I hope you guys like, comment, subscribe. Alrighty, guys. So, yes, it is windy out here. And, yes, go let you guys know, I am doing an unboxing on the Demon Slayer plush from Great Eastern. And, yes... Uh, there's a new Demon Slayer movie that just released in theaters yesterday. Uh, which some people said is actually a tie-in to the Season 3 finale. Which, uh, yep, Season 4 is confirmed. So, let's go ahead and get this out of the bag and show you what it is. I got the Great Eastern Mystery Plush. Um, yes, I got the Ben Presto one, but that one's for plush videos, but I have not yet used that one for a plush video yet, which I need to get around to it, but anyway, let's go ahead and get her out of the bag, shall we? Here's the plush tag, which I already took off, and yes, very well detailed, did. this unboxing and plush unboxing... I mean, plush unboxing and review is going to get 100 out of 100. But anyway, guys, I hope you guys like, comment, subscribe. Okay, guys. I am back with another video, and happy Tuesday. So, have you guys ever tried these Cheetos pretzels? Um, I bought these, like, two days ago at my Walmart. And I gotta say, um, they're alright, but not that good. I mean, like, they're just pretzels covered up in cheese, like the Cheetos stuff. See, you get a pretzel side and a cheesy side. I mean, yeah, I I haven't had Cheetos in, like, a year. These has been out since, like, September or October of last year. And what's my thoughts about these? Um, like I said, they're not that good, but they're okay and alright. So, yep, uh-huh. I'll pop, probably put this in my March unboxing compilation because I haven't done a food review in like a while. So, yeah. But anyway, guys, I hope you guys like, comment, subscribe. Okay, guys. So, from the last video, yes, um, I finally got my hands on the... Super Mario Brothers movie Princess Peach action figure. Now, yes, I haven't done a Super Mario Brothers movie unboxing related since, well, unwrapping related since the a day before the Super Mario 
Brothers movie released in theaters last April. So, yep, I got this at Walmart at the Clarence Idol for $12.50. So, yep, uh, there's the side, the back. Really cool picture of Princess Peach, the side, and the front. I did not mean to move the camera. But let's go ahead and get it out of the box in 3, 2, 1. Alrighty, guys. Before we look at the little figurine here, let's look at the accessory she e, comes with. It's her little umbrella, which I think this is probably a reference to her little umbrella flying technique from Super Smash Bros. Ultimate, I guess. I don't know. I haven't played that game in months. So, yep, uh, there's the accessory, and here is the figurine. Now, check this out. Uh, she could do her little, like, hit combo move from Smash Ultimate. Her arms go slightly up and down. Up and down. The other one kind of goes like this, too. Her head slightly rotates and everything else. And this unboxing and review is going to get a 100 out of a 100. And I hope you guys like, comment, subscribe.